Hello everyone, I'm Todd. And I'm Alex. And welcome to the How to Quest podcast, where we uh, listen to our magical mirror that shows us our alternate reality selves, Bustang, hoarder of soaps, and Finkelstein, tamer of steeds. And today we're joined by our friend uh, Orlando. Hey guys, how are you? I'm Orlando. Um, in terms of the magical mirror, uh, you can refer to me as Rango, the king of goats. Yes, the mirror did uh, in its uh, weekly message right before the actual message. It mentioned we were going to be in a lake and we were going to meet someone named Rango when uh, Orlando showed up. So, you can See, only assume. Seems like we're going fishing even, I think. Yeah, I think... I think so. I mean, what else are you going to do at a lake? Swim? We can swim. I'm, I'm not a strong swimmer. No, you could always... I'm a swimmer. Swimming is always an option, you know, but if we're being realistic, if you're going out on a lake, probably in some sort of boat, floating on it, and uh, you're yeah. going to want to cast a line into the water, you know, and see see what you pull up from, from the depths of the... <laughs> the depths? The depths of the lake. Of the lake. Yeah, yeah. Very deep lake. <laughs> Well, I know it was quite the uh, the fish wrangler. What do you? What's the like the largest fish you've caught in a lake? Listen, I could I could uh, tell you a couple stories, <laughs> but uh, you know, there's a, there's a lake in our little hometown. You guys might be some of you might be familiar with it, uh, Amston Lake. But uh, I, uh, I I pulled a four and a half pound bass out of that wow. lake one day. Yep, fishing out from the point. R.I.P. Ah, yes, but, uh, that's the point. That was the point. That was a big fish. That was a big fish. That's good. I remember when we uh, built a raft, fifteen by fifteen feet, I think. Yeah, I'm a and you know the the it measurements, the measurements size, aren't. Right? Uh, it was supposed to be. <laughs> they weren't too precise. Max, and yeah. we were just like, nah, we're fifteen by fifteen. Yeah, it'll we'll be yeah. fine. Who needs like rules and regulations? At that time. Yeah, but I don't think I've ever caught as many fish in like a four day period uh, ever in my life you just go out there and they were literally just like us attacking the hooks that you threw in the water you know uh one of one of the days just a a quick little story uh one of the days it was definitely it i think pretty pretty confident it was saturday but um not not sure who else was on the raft that day but um i know myself uh spencer brown and i believe John Presh was also there, but we took it out and we were we were doing some hardcore fishing. And uh, Spencer went; he had his line in the water and he hooked a monster. And this thing's head was the size of four of my fists. I kid you not. <laughs> but he got it up to the side of the raft, and just from just from sheer excitement of how big this fish was he went and tried to pull it just with his rod up onto the raft snapped the line that's how that's how big this fish was it was crazy never never seen a bigger fish come out of that that little lake there <laughs> old bessie old i bessie, remember that yeah, story yeah, i remember old bessie. old bessie she got away i don't think she was seen again no Never seen again. Yeah, and then the raft didn't was uh, not regulation, so the uh, whoever owned the lake found it and yeah. uh, forced us to remove it. They shut, <laughs> they shut we, us like, down. We would lose it multiple times. We got stolen a couple times. Yeah, there were some a uh, couple hoodlums across the lake there where uh, oh, yeah, from where we were docking them. it. They uh, they were they were so adamant on taking this raft that we have that we created that they cut the chain we were using to chain it to the tree I forgot about that right that's how crazy these kids were <laughs> but uh don't don't be fooled we got that raft back <laughs> many times we Ma- got that many raft times back. Many we sold search parties yeah. daily for it uh, yeah we sure did <laughs> pretty good pretty good rafting days that was definitely like one of the best weeks of any summer i can remember honestly yeah, that, was that, was, fun. that was a good time all right. Well, I think the uh, light on the mirror is turning on, so right, let's, looks let's like the message is about in. to come yeah. in. We'll listen in. Uh, all right. We'll just set up the mics and we'll see you on the other side.
So, uh, does this this go on to you? Um, I think so. The the light is it's on. It's like it's there. It's red. Yeah, but so, it's, it's blinking a little bit. Isn't it supposed to be steady? Yeah, it was. It was steady last time, wasn't it? I think so. I don't, it was a week ago. I don't really remember it. <laughs> It might not even work for all we know, but, you know, might as well just in case. We're just going to go with it. Okay. So, uh, greetings, once again, citizens of Roadbed. And, uh, of course you know who we are, uh, but just so, just in case there's any newcomers, I am Finkelstein. I tame steeds, and I tame them greatly. I'm here with... Bustang, hoarder of soaps. And, uh, yeah, that, just in case any fairies were born again... In like the past two minutes, they would they I would not know who we were. Fairies so much. They're assholes. They're assholes. They're fairies assholes. Are all they do is bully babies. babies. No. That's really all they do. <laughs> that's that's like their point is they bully babies. But regardless, we are here out on this lake. Yeah, we uh we may have commandeered a boat. We commandeered it. We'll we'll just leave it at that. It was it was just kind of sitting there on the on the shore. And, uh... Now it's ours. Yeah, now it's ours. It's like soap. You just kind of take it, and then it's yours. Yeah, and, it, you know, boats and soap don't really belong to anyone. So, you know, there's soap for grabs around here. Exactly. So we're out here on Lake uh, Winnebago Babo, and, uh... Bago or Babo? I thought it was Babo. Bago, Babo, Tomato, Tomano. What did the sign say? We just passed it. I don't remember. What? What do you? Who do you think I am? The rememberer. You could be the rememberer. How should I know? I wouldn't know any of that. The one. rememberer lives in a mountain, like on the other side of the country. He remembers everything that's ever happened. Ah, we should visit him sometime. Yeah, we definitely should. If uh, if the shredders go that way, for sure. But I think I see something over there in the lake. Do you? Well, yeah, it's moving a little bit in there. I don't know. Maybe a <laughs> fish or something? Yeah, someone's like swimming around over there. Hey! Hey! What? What? It, I, I that, think he called out to us. Hey! 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 Guys! Over there! You! Yeah, you! Wait! Hey, get over here! Get over here! Get over here! room for one more? Yeah, yeah, we can make some room. Make yeah, it, we can make some room in our boat. Oh, great, great, great. Here, let me just unload my uh, fishing gear I got with me here. You're swimming with fishing gear? Yeah, you know, uh... I, I'm a big fisherman, and, uh, you know, I find the best way to catch fish is to be with the fish in the water. Uh, oh, that, you, that You, you that wouldn't have sense. happened to have uh, lost a boat recently, have you? Uh, no, I have not lost a boat. Okay, no, okay, I've, I've, I've I'm, I'm just checking. I've never been in my life. That's, mm, that's, okay. that's good. That's, that's good. good. Yeah. That's just, you know, it's just, it's a good thing. It's polite to ask people if they Misplaced have a boat. Things, yeah. Because yeah, no, we de- definitely yeah. didn't take this boat. Yeah, thanks for checking, though. Um, yeah, but uh, I think we actually have our own fishing gear. You uh, you down for a little bit of uh, a little round of fishing? Yeah, yeah. I'll toss my line in. I've never done it really? from uh, this floating platform you got here. So how do you how do you, how do you, well. do you do you how do you hold the rod when you're in the water? Oh, it's all you got to tread water. You should you see these calf muscles? Oh, you know, those are those are pretty yeah. impressive calf muscles. Yeah, you gotta you gotta tread water the whole time. This way, you can keep your hands above the water to cast. Yeah. I mean, it seems effective. Seems like we should start fishing in the water. Because I, those calf muscles, those are the kinds of calf muscles that take down shredders. Yeah, you know, I, uh, I can't, you know, I, fishing, I can't give all the credit to fishing for these calf muscles. Um, just, to, uh, just to introduce myself. My name is Rango, and I'm the king of goats. Wow. Oh, wow. Yeah, sorry for not uh, introducing ourselves no, that's before. A, that's okay. That's okay. I'm a Bustang, hoarder of soaps. Bustang, okay. And I'm Finkelstein, tamer of steeds. Finkelstein. Nice to meet you, fellas. All right. Well, uh, hold on. Let me uh, let me go through our gear here. Here's, here's a rod. Uh, thank here's you, a rod. Thank you. All right, I'll get mine. All right. Well, uh, I... Here's as good as any place. Let's just uh, cast out. All right, I'll uh, I'll cast from this side over here. You guys can take the front and the the opposite. Yeah, we'll take the, the uh, so the front and the back. The front and the back. Yeah, the front the, and the, uh, back. the the bow and the, and the, the stern. The stern, huh? Is uh, the stern front? Which is which again? 
Is the stern the front or is it the back? Uh, I think it's the front. Well, it I don't think me. any of us have ever actually been on a boat before, so this is all new to us. Yeah, this is new for all of us, I think. <laughs> all right, I'm just going to go to the front. Okay, I'll, I'll And you back. go, I'll go to back. the back. Yeah. And you take the side. All right, I'll take the side. All right, all right, all right. All right, let me, let me get this worm on and uh, cast it out. I, I got mine stuck in my shirt. I need some help. Oh, uh, God. <laughs> all right. Do you have pliers? Nah. No pliers? All right, here. I got a pair of pliers. Yeah, you got some pliers with you. Thank you. Yeah, there you, you go. And uh, you can actually flip that out. There's a knife on it if you got to oh, cut okay. it out, all right? Beautiful, thank you, thank no you. Problem. Right, here no we go. Now, now, now we're ready to go. Oh, right, oh yeah, I I'm think ready. I got a bite. Yeah. Oh, he's got oh, a bite. He got a bite. What do you got? In there? Oh, I don't. Oh my gosh! All right, I'm, I'm reeling. I'm reeling. Uh, oh, I can. Reeling. The entire lake is moving while you're reeling. Oh, my gosh, this thing's huge. This thing is huge. Oh my God! Oh, oh my hold on, oh, the boat's oh, shaking. Oh, what do you have on your line? What's in this oh, lake? Oh, guys, guys! To hang on. Hang on. Oh my gosh, we're going for a ride. It's taking on it. It's just pulling us. What's it's under there? Guys, I'm out of line. I'm out of line. There's no more line. Oh my god. Alright. Oh, this, this, this is bad. This is bad. This is bad. This is bad. Alright. It's all fine. Right. It's fine. We just gotta hold on. Alright. We gotta cut the line. We gotta cut the line. We gotta cut it. Hey, I need those pliers back. It's got my hey, knife. Hey, you got pliers. You got pliers. No! You, you, no! It's, it's in slipped. the water! I slipped. Hold on. I'm supposed to get it. I got the soap sword. So we started cutting. Got it. <laughs> got it. <laughs> Gosh. Oh, oh God! God. All right, okay. it seems to have settled down, um, but it. I mean, what was, what was that? that? What was That's that? what I, I want to know. I've never. I've been fishing this lake for years, and never in my life have I come across something like that. I think. I think we should probably investigate, honestly. And yeah, by us, I think ha you should investigate, Ranko. <laughs> Me? Yeah. I, I think mean, you should investigate. Yeah, I mean, you've been in these waters for years, right? Yeah, you're swimming in these waters. You're you know what? That's fine. I'll just, I'll hop in and I'll take a peek. Just uh, give me like 10 minutes, all right? All right, we'll ten give you 10 minutes. minutes. Okay, we'll, we'll right, give you 10 minutes. We'll give you 10 minutes. 10 minutes. Oh, okay. Actually, wait. You know what? I got a rope in my backpack. I'm going to tie it around my belt. Okay. Then I'll tie it to me, and then I'll tie it to Buse Day. Don't do that. That's that's a bad <laughs> idea. Why would you do that? Don't. That don't. seems like a fairly fine just, idea. Ficklestein, that's against the point. We're trying to get him to go in the water for us. Just keep it in the boat, all right? And right, could, right. Look, put it through this little loop at the front here, all right? So it allows me to pull slack while I go down. And um, if I yank on the boat three times... That means I need you guys to pull me up quick. Okay, got it. Pull you All up right. quick. All right. Well, I'll see you boys in a little bit. Good luck. Good luck. All right. Well, he's gone. Uh, what do we do now? <laughs> I kind of don't want to be on this boat <laughs> if that thing's in the water. Well, we don't have any paddles. We kind of just floated out here. How do we get back to shore? Uh, I have a soap sword. Of a soap sword. That's that going to dissolve in the water? Yeah, you're right, actually. <laughs> I didn't think about that. <laughs> ah, darn it. Soap has more weaknesses than I thought back when I started hoarding it. You'd think. Yeah, you'd think. Um, well, we could just try fishing again. I don't know if that's a good idea after what happened last time. Uh, I mean, at least if it starts moving again, then Rango will be able to see it easier it'll bring it up to the That's surface true. all all we're doing is helping him get a better look at what's in there yeah we're basically. really good people when it comes we're down to where we start fishing right now yeah it's the best it's the morally correct choice to just start fishing again okay all right all right so all right, here here's, here's, here's a worm here's a worm we'll just put these on spear this bitch all right okay all right fishing it's a very exciting thing to talk on a magical mirror about. Water's pretty calm today. Uh, pretty, <laughs> yeah, bro. I mean, right now, for the time being, pretty calm. We almost just got <laughs> destroyed by whatever was in here. <laughs> yeah, but, you know, the sun's shining. The uh, mountain is behind us. In that cave, I don't want to talk about it. But, uh, right, right. You know, it's a, it's a good day, other than that. Wait, hold on. I think I the boat's moving. Is it the rope? Check the rope. Oh, that, oh it, is, it is the rope. 
Do, do we pull them up? Yeah, we gotta pull them up. Okay, we gotta pull them up. Pull them up. Pull the thing. I pull the thing. Oh my god. This rope. Oh my god. Guys, get me up here. Get me up here. Alright, alright, alright. Do you guys have pools in the water? Yes. Yeah. You have. Get them in quick. Get them in quick. No, I'm here. Hold on. 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 Hold
Oh, absolutely. That is quite the acknowledgement time. right there. Yeah. yeah. All right. Well, luckily, we're just about there. I can see it. It's a pretty, pretty nice house. Thank you. Good. Thank you. Yeah, nice my uh, my great 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 grandfather built it way way back when way back when when these uh, when when this lake first first was inhibited by uh, us people. Wow, that's that's some rich history right there. Yep, we've been uh, we've been farming this land for for decades. Well, it's all the more important than than that we clear the lake of this presence. Absolutely, I agree. All right, so let's go get this goat. So he should be should be sitting right right in his little barn here. There he is. Oh yeah, okay. Oh, he'd make a great sacrifice yeah, just yeah, looking at yeah, him. Yeah, he's a big guy. That, he's a big guy. If I had to describe that goat, I would say that is a that is a sacrificial goat. Yeah. It's, yeah, he does. Yeah. I just like I I want to like stab it with my sword right now just looking at it it's very tempting well, I'm going to resist yeah yeah, yeah I'm yeah, going to definitely resist, resist. Definitely should, yeah yeah definitely resist it's just giving me that look <laughs> like please stab me <laughs> <laughs> so so listen we'll walk them we'll just walk them down to the lake um and then I was thinking maybe we maybe we put the goat in the boat and, and then send and, the boat and off. And then send the boat off instead, because goats can't—they can't swim. They're yeah. Not, they're not the greatest swimmers, so I want to make sure he gets out there to the to the the higher depths of the lake, the greater depths out there, because um, I'm pretty confident that's where the monster's going to be. What it's a very think? deep lake. Yeah. Well, uh, apparently. So. Yeah. All right, so let's get him in here, and we'll uh, we'll just we'll just Should tie we him down. Say some words or something to the lake monster. You know, I'll I'll say a few words. Okay, I'll okay. say. All right, a few well, words. first you should you should call out for uh, four face because I feel like we might need four face uh, later on. Okay, I have my four face whistle with me that I crafted. Oh yes, time to put that thing to use. Let's yeah. uh, let's try it out. Let's see if he learned anything. <laughs> that was a beautiful whistle. I I think I can, I can hear him. He's sloughing. He's oh just, man! Oh, here we he just go. took out those trees. We're really sorry if those were your trees. He <laughs> no, just kind of okay. barrels that's through those. Not. He kind of I mean, does that. He just okay. he just barrels through things a lot. So here's my uh, my land squid. His name is Fourface, as you see. Fourface. Uh, does he? he four doesn't. faces. They're kind of swirling about him right now. They, okay. they they tend to do that. He's got a seductive face on. Have him change it. It's <laughs> giving us a bad impression. Face. Change the face. Okay, but, but he's, he's got his board face on. All right, all right. He's not actually bored. That's just one of his four faces. So okay. Maybe it is. We don't know, he, he doesn't have many options for expressions. It's just yeah. each face is its own expression. All right. Yeah. Well, it's uh, it's nice to meet your four face creature here. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. Yeah, um, all right, well, let's just ride him back. That'll be a lot faster than walking. Yeah, that's true. All right, here, just hop on. You just kind of just... Hop on All right. wherever you can on his body, really, right. and then Sounds just ride us. All right, hold on. All right, four face, take us away. <laughs> he's going pretty fast. He's going good. Yeah, well, yeah, he's he's building up some speed here. We've also barreled through all these trees, so I mean, I guess if you need firewood, they're already cut down. Yeah, for you. we made a lot of firewood for the poor citizens who can't afford it. So just head over to the uh, the uh, greenwood forest, and there's a lot of down trees there. Yeah. All right. All right, Four Face, let us down. All right, so uh, let's just all get in the canoe and uh, head out. All right, sounds good. All right, you got the goat? Got the goat. All right, that'll be good. Good thing you didn't forget the goat. I couldn't see him on the other side of Four Face. No, yeah, no, he was up there. Yeah, I, I, I brought him up there. All right, uh, all right. Well, um, let's put him on. All right, all right so we'll just, uh, just kick us out again. <laughs> Or we can wait ten hours. No, it's okay. We have no. time. We have time. <laughs> Who knows how long this magic mirror will last? Yeah. Um, no. Listen, we'll just we'll put them up there, and if you guys want to help push, we'll yeah, just we'll, we'll send, send them out them there. Out. Okay. We'll send them out there. Does that sound good? That sounds. All good right. All right. All right. We'll get them up there. All right. And ready on the on the count of three. One, right. two, three. <laughs> All, All right. right. There he goes. Uh, you want to say some words, or? So this goat, his name was uh, Prince Albert. It's been a, he's been a friend, a best friend, 
And uh, ever since my wife passed away, I I looked for him in his old age and his his wisdom to uh, lead me and lead the herd. And he's he's done a good job. And uh, I think his his life will not be wasted by being a uh, a sacrificial goat to this lake monster. That was beautiful. Thank you. Yeah, that was, was very good. That, that, was, was, really that, good. that was really touching. I think if the goat had not already been sacrificed, he would have shed a goat tear. Yes. Yes. At that. I'm sure he's shedding tears right now. Can well, you guys see is. him out there? I, I can't see him anymore. I think I lost sight of him. Yeah, he definitely went under. Okay. So I, I think it worked. Hopefully like, right? it is. So worked. I don't know. I think we just uh we just we just gotta give it some time. I don't uh I don't really wanna jump in and check things out right now. Yeah, it's uh, probably not safe just yet. Yeah, I don't want him I don't want this monster to think I'm a second sacrifice. I wouldn't want that to happen. No, for for sure. Let's just uh just climb up in here really quick and uh we'll we'll wait out to the uh, storm metaphorically. Okay. Because it's a beautiful day. It is a very beautiful, it's a beautiful day. day. It is a beautiful yeah, day. It's, uh, we don't have we don't have uh, we don't have too much rain out here. Um, it's only only three seasons. So, three seasons, uh, really. Three se- Yeah, we don't we don't do the winter thing out here. That's nice. That's nice. Yeah, no snow. You, you get the rain. But that's that's about it. Yeah, the people uh, up here in these eastern lands don't really. Uh, they they certainly do things a little bit differently than we did back in roadbed. That's for sure. Yeah. Yep. Yeah, it's been uh, it's been a while since uh, since we've seen snow. So we've just uh, we it's almost like we've discontinued winter. Wow. Yep. I I wish I could do that back home. Yeah. Yep. Yeah, it's nice. It's nice. Yeah, it is. It is snowy. It's like first first there's uh there's ice there's ice everywhere. That's that's summer. That's summer in roadbed. We basically have four winters in where, where we're from. Four winters. We have yeah. four winters. Wow. And the spring is mm, fire. Everything's on fire. That's crazy. It's not easy in roadbed. It's the fire winter, we call it. Which is why we need all the cheese we can get. And is why we are on our quest. Oh, you guys are on a quest? I didn't even know. What quest is this? Well, um... You you may have heard that Roadbed was recently robbed of our supply of cheese. I did, you know, I I read that in the uh, Centennial Times. Yeah. Now we we have reason to believe that a group of marauding lesbians has stolen the cheese. What? They're known they're known as the Shredders. Have you heard of them? The Shredders. Yes. I I can't say I have. You know, I think I've read about them in the Times, but no, I've never. I mean. Never heard any stories other than what I've read. Well, if you see them, they're very dangerous, and they're full of... They have lots of cheese. They have so, all of our cheese. At this point, it's probably going to smell very bad. We're trying to get it back. So, let me ask you guys this. What do you, what do you guys do with the cheese? What's, what's the cheese for? The cheese is it's for a lot of things. The cheese is pretty much for everything. What can you use cheese for? You use it uh, for breakfast... Use it for lunch. Use it for dinner. You can use it for dinner. You can, uh, there's a guy named Mac in our village, and he goes around, and he collects all the cheese, and he pours it on himself, and he just goes and he feeds all the animals all of the cheese. So he's essential, he's essential to the, uh, to the farmers in our, in our town. Yeah, and, he, uh, actually, I think, I think I've sold milk to a guy named Mac. Oh really? Out in road. You know him. He's in road bed, right? Yes, he is in road bed. Yeah, I, you know, because I've got all the goats, and I milk them, and you know, I make some cheese for myself, but um, but most mostly I just sell the milk, and actually, Mac in road bed is one of my biggest buyers. That I haven't heard from him. That, yeah. I haven't heard from him in a while, though. I, but I don't know how to how else to get uh, get a hold of him. We've been we've been away ourselves for quite a while out in this quest, but if we if we return, we'll uh, we'll be sure to pass along your message that you want to continue your business. Absolutely, thank you. And, yeah. and protect your cheese at all costs. By yeah, all no, means. I definitely I, will. I'd be I very careful will. if I were you. I uh, 
tell you what, if you guys are if you guys are hungry while we're waiting this out, I uh you know I could put out a little platter of uh of cheese. You got some cheese? If you guys are interested. Yeah, that's, I mean, I'm not going to say no to cheese. It's I'll, been, I'll, I'd have to indulge. It's been a very long time since we've had cheese. Yeah. They did not give us any when we left Roadbed because it was stolen. Yeah, we didn't have any. Wow. Well, see, I just so happened to have made a fresh batch this morning. So That sounds wonderful. Yeah, that's yeah. awesome. That is quite a wheel of cheese. I have never eaten a whole wheel of cheese before. Yeah, yeah. I uh, usually make a couple wheels at a time. This time, uh, milk milk was a little short this this morning, so had to just stick with the one. But um, I'm pretty confident you guys are gonna like it. All right. Well, we'll just snack on this while we wait. But I mean, what else do you got in that in that fishing bag of yours? You got cheese. You got what? What else is there? I uh, well, listen. I've got some. I've got some meats. Oh, yeah. Some meats. Yep, yep, yep. Uh, some, some, uh, some dried and cured meats goes great with cheese. I also have some bread. Um, if you have fish, I, I, I keep those in there, or else Four Face will get a little, a little rowdy. Yeah, oh, okay. Four, All right. Yeah, he's well, got his creepy smile face on now. Well, do, I mean, on the shore. Do, does he need a snack? Because I, does he eat fish? He eats fish bodies. He doesn't fish eat the heads. Fish, but well, I mean, if, is he hungry? We could give. I could give him a fish. I've got plenty in the bag. Okay, then, then, yeah, then, yeah, all right. We can go for we'll, it. Call him over. Call him over. Yo, four face. Four face. Come all on, right, come he's on. coming. Four face. Here, here you go. Do I just, yeah, yeah, just throw, just throw, throw it. Just throw it. Yeah. So used to yeah. him being on land. It's weird to see four face the squid in water. It's uh, almost unnatural. I don't, I don't think he's used to it either. Yeah, I know. He looks very, uh, very not comfortable mm. right now. Yeah, yeah, he he looks and looks like he's suffering from some discomfort. It's, it's, but hold on, four face. He's he's making a weird face that is not one of his four faces right now. He looks like he's in pain. In four pain. face, are you all right? Four face, is he four okay? Face? Hold on, he's going under. Something's pulling him down. Do you think it's the it's the oh, beast? Be, the, uh, grab the rope, grab four the face. rope, grab the rope. Four face, four, four face, catch this. the rope. <laughs> Oh god, he's going under! I'm going under too! Pull! Pull! Oh, I'm leaving him behind! I can't go in! My soap sword would dissolve! Go! I'm going in! Oh god! Oh god! The boat's rocking again! It's going wild! I hope... I hope Finkelstein's alright! I hope he can breathe! Hold his breath! Well, I know he can breathe! He's breathing all the time! Really heavily! It's very annoying! I tell him to stop all the time! He won't... He's always just breathing. But wait, hold on, there's Fourface! And there's Finkelstein! Uh, They've just looked out of the water! Face. And uh, there's the beast! It's uh, face! It's one of its faces! Alright, hold on, hold on, I'm going over! I'm gonna jump on it, I'm gonna stab it with my soap sword. Quick, paddle me over! Alright, quick! Alright, here I come! Jump! Ah! Oh god, I think that just made it angry! It just stood up! Now, here's the other five faces. What do we do? Somebody get me off this thing! Four face, throw your tackle over. You stay, grab on. I'm grabbing on. Pull me in. I got you. Wait, guys, I forgot. I have this spear gun in my bag, too. Oh, God. All right, use it. Use it quick. Okay. You only got one shot. Oh, direct hit. <laughs> oh, man. It went through all five of its eyes. I can't believe that. I think it's dead. It fell over. Wow. It's not moving. Let's get a little closer and see. Yeah. Yeah, let's you take know, a good I've, look. You got to make sure. I've heard this. from some of my neighbors who do some hunting. The only way to see if the animal's truly dead is to poke it in its eye. Well, you kind of destroyed all the eyes. Exactly. Ah. You are truly a wise, Rango. Thank you. I would ask you to go on our quest with us, but I fear your goats need tending now that you've gotten rid of your most sacrificial. They absolutely do. You know, I, uh, if, there's, if, there's any, if there's ever anything I could do for you fellas, just, just write me a letter, and uh, I, can, I can take some vacation time every now and then if you guys ever needed a hand. 
Oh, great. We may need to call upon you. Definitely. Any anytime you guys need it, you guys really help me out here because now I I don't have to worry about this monster anymore. And uh, like I said, please pass my message along to Mac. Uh, Mac will we'll definitely hear from the you next time if you we see end up him. seeing him. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. What's uh What's your address that we should uh, send the letter to? It's uh forty two Johnson Avenue. Johnson Avenue. Yeah, yeah. But it's it's the big Johnson, not the little Johnson. The, there's there's two Johnsons? Yeah, there's two Johnsons, so you gotta send it to the bigger Johnson. The bigger Johnson. Yeah. Ah, okay. Okay. Yeah, yeah, okay. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, it's got the capital J. I hear gotcha. I hear the little Johnson sucks a lot. Yeah, yeah. They're uh you know, they're they they all they smell bad and they're not the nicest people over there on on the little Johnson app. Yeah, it sounds very disappointing, honestly. Yeah, really, really is. All right, well, uh, you want to paddle us to shore, and we'll uh, yeah, we'll get you guys to shore, and we can uh, we can part ways from there. All right, great. All right, all right. Well, uh, it's been a very nice meeting you, Rango. Yes, and nice meeting you guys as well. All right, well, we uh, should be on our way, and I think it's uh, perfect timing. The mirror, it's uh, now it's blanking oh, now again. It's now blinking. it's blanking okay. again. I, so, I uh, really don't know how this thing I'm works. I'm pretty sure it's going off, that means. Yeah, I think I think our time is almost up. So, citizens of Roadbed, uh, we've been a little sidetracked in our quest, but we're going to be right back on it next week. We made a lot of firewood. You're and welcome. we made a lot of firewood for our new friend, Rango. And uh, once again, thank you, Rango. No problem, guys. All right. And... Uh, we will see you all next week.